Welcome to the final My Rise Unleashed. This um won't be a last 2K24 stream because we still have the last one which is we still have the last one which is basically the men's story of the My Rise. So Yeah, we're finishing off today. We did everything we did. We did everything. Well, not upgrading all this, but I'm still in a, like a little predicament of choosing of my um my uh my character for the mint. I don't know if I want to make it a striker or a high flyer. So it's still in my mind, but. Anyway, yesterday we have finished Rhea's story, and now today we finished all three. Let's see what Rhea has to say now. Someone's been busy, hasn't she? Yes. I'd like to think I understood the assignment. That you have, and it's still the tip of the iceberg. I have a fantastic opportunity for you. I'm listening. How would you like to try your hand at one of the most unique experiences in WWE? A position where you'll be able to set the agenda, take control of the whole of the WWE universe, and truly make a mark. And this magical mystery opportunity will let me do all that? Indeed. 
in the prestigious role of WWE Raw General Manager. Isn't that you? What, are you going on vacation or something? Well, now that you mention it, I may have plans. Aha! Ooh! But this is fertile ground for you too. Stepping into a WWE authority role, applying your talents to the other side of sports entertainment. Sure, booking may be a balancing act sometimes, but you already know that from your work as co-owner of TBD. You have to choose. Um... I feel... Let's see what I'm not convinced do. that this offer isn't just because you want a vacation. Yeah. But nonetheless, I'll do it. Splendid! I can't wait to catch my flight. <clears throat> um, uh, see you in action. Okay. So when do I start? Okay, Rico. Well, I should start heading to the airport. <laughs> so, how's now? Seriously? Don't worry, Raw practically GMs itself. Sure, Bianca needs a challenger for Survivor Series. Bailey and Becky have both been bothering me incessantly about their booking, oh, and the Bailey. suits in Stamford okay. are especially like sensitive thought, to ratings right now. But you'll figure it out. All that GMs itself? Are you sure that's it? Yes. Oh, wait, no. Charlotte needs an opponent for tonight. Actually, this is a good way for you to set the tone of how you'll be running Raw. Every match should tell a story, so you just need to decide which story you'd like to tell. Such as? Are you going to choose an up-and-comer like Nikita Lyons to challenge the Queen? Maybe someone she has a lot of history with, like Rhea Ripley. Or uh... maybe you want to dig into Charlotte's past a bit further. She goes way back with Natalia including the feud that made Charlotte the first woman to hold all major singles titles in WWE. So, what kind of story do you want to tell? Who will you choose to take on Charlotte? Okay. I'm actually, I'm closing my eyes. Okay, good, yeah. On one hand, Nikita, then I heard she got injury, so, I don't know. On another hand, Rhea Ripley, but, uh, but, uh, hold on. Hold on, you know what happened? I took that <laughs> Oh, she's still in the hospital. <laughs> her. And there's Natalia. All right, so, well, I'm going at random. I'm going at random, so... Yeah, I don't know. Wh whatever it lands on, I'll choose. Yeah, okay, okay, so far, everything's good for OBS. And it's well. It's Rhea. I may have history with Rhea Ripley, but that also means I know she's a formidable opponent. I'd like to see her face Charlotte. Fantastic choice. Well, good luck to you. I have every confidence. And just a word of advice: do try to be as neutral as possible as GM. You may find yourself rooting for the talent you put forth. Sometimes even as strongly as if you were in the ring yourself. Ah. Heavy is the head. Heavy is the head of Dirty General Manager. Storygate. He did everything. So it's time to enter. There is a new boss on Monday. It's a new era on Raw as the captain helms the ship to temporary general manager. So far, it looks promising. Cap has made one match here, Cole. Let's not give her GM of the year just yet. I agree, Corey. This is a good start, but let's see what else Cap has planned. Oh, man. Oh, come on, Charlotte. Oh, driving oh, the elbow. Come on, Charlotte. Vicious headbutt. 
Yeah. Ripley has her sights set on her opponent now. That intimidation factor of Charlotte getting a bit challenged there. An eruption of offense from Ripley. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. Set up in the corner of the ring. Oh, the elbow nailed it. I can't do possum attack? Uh-oh. I can't counter it. No, Charlotte. No. Reversal. What no. a counter. Yeah. Lands the elbow. Stops Ripley's attack. Exploder oh. suplex. Here's the cover. cover. She kicks out with authority. Getting that shoulder up seemed to Pathetic. be pretty easy. Pathetic, Charlotte. Big oh. boot. Okay. Don't you? Oh, nice balance. Into the knee drop. And into the count. Not even close to down and out at this no. point. Oh, well scouted by Ripley. Punch straight um, to the face, stays off the attack. Nope. Sight. Oh, and she turns it around. She shoots up the top rope. Dane. From ah. Oh, look out. Coming down on their opponent like a sack of bricks. Kick hits the mark. Squaring off right by our announce table. Whip back into the ring. Rhea getting uh, everyone in nah, attendance okay. to rally behind her. Stupid. Rhea Ripley has her opponent up for the electric chair. And oh! Devastating face buster. There's that true brutality of Rhea Ripley. Mm. Nobody does it quite like mommy. Rhea Ripley with the riptide. No doubt Ripley pin. just ended this. Able what? to stop the pin count here. Oh, <laughs> kick lands. Oh. Yeah. Showing up their deadlifting Strength. prowess and just tossing them aside. Oh, I'm not done yet. I'm not done yet. Oh, oh, man. Good golly, what a knee. And Charlotte can't find an answer for these attacks. Charlotte's got to get it together to avoid disaster. Oh. Charlotte's showing how much punishment she can withstand before dishing out some of her own. The U-turn Charlotte needed in this match could have been that right there. Oh. Big elbow. Roundhouse kick. Grabs the leg. Just tops their opponent. And then we do it in the again. Line of danger. Rhea set up. with a rope break. And she can't count it. That's fine. Setting up for opponent. Here it comes. Rip time. That might topple the queen. The nightmare has toppled the queen. I can't wait for Rhea to return and beat up Liv Morgan. An intense competition between these two dominant young women, oh, that's no, for I'm sure. Sorry. And I imagine we'll have the pleasure of seeing them in battle again in the future. But tonight, Rhea Ripley is showing Charlotte Flair her brutality. Yeah. Now what for us? What is our next objective as general manager? Are we gonna fire someone? Let's fire. Let's fire that bum Troy. General manager of Raw? Did you do a career pivot? I'm still an in-ring competitor, but this was an opportunity I couldn't refuse. Don't think Regal would have let me refuse it, actually. But being an authority figure in WWE does seem like a rite of passage that's very cool. Listen, this job is a real responsibility. You have superstar slipping to your DMs, catching you backstage, asking for favors. Don't be wooed by the intention and the fun part of the job and neglect the real work. Real work isn't being general manager or a promoter just moving names around on the whiteboard. Kidding. 
I'm taking this seriously. Hey, why don't you come to a taping soon and see firsthand? Besides, how cool will it be to see me running the show for the first time? We'll certainly be a departure for our TBD days. Yo! Joe Magic Cat did! I just happened to hear that Bianca needs our next opponent. I have the best suggestion. Spoiler. It's me, Bailey versus Bianca. Alliteration. It sounds even great. I know you have a big decision about who's going to have a challenge Bianca for the next time. I love it. The opportunity to face her Survivor Series. Give me back so I can prove I'm the right choice. Bianca will be temporarily... Look at, that, look, at that, look 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 at that, Be Becky's thinking, she's like, I'll be in my favor. No, Becky, besides, you're already a champion in real life. You're, by the time of this stream, she's currently the world, the women's world champion, so. Oh. And so is Bailey. Bailey's the WWE women's champion right now. Is it we trade a few victories and losses now. Just know that the next win is mine. No, unless if I'm the general manager. Wow, wow, wow. Wow. Hi, Lita. Wow, wow, wow. Maybe I should put you in a match. Hmm. Wait. Um. Let me see something. Uh, let's see. Oh. Day cargo arrives on September 20th. Let me see what's in the video pack. The next one is Post Malone and Frank. Oh. Ooh, the Honky Tonk Man. Jimmy Hart. Ooh. Basher, Monch, Sensational Sherry, Post Malone. All him and MasterCard. Easy, W. I'm reading the DLC list. I know that already the ECW pack came out, so I know CM Punk is already out. Pat McAfee pack, I don't know. I feel like this will be the less... This will be the less likely to be... I feel like DLC packs 2 and 3 will be less sold, but... The, the second DLC has the Honky Talk Man, so this is actually something. DLC... Let's see DLC for Jay Cargill, Nia Jax, Michelle McCool, Carlito, Kyrie Sane, Liar Valkyria, Dragon Lee. Wow. WCW, DDP. Oh, <gasps> Young Sheik. We're going to. Ooh, the Great Muda. Ooh. Lex Luger, Mr. Perfect. Wow. I hope it's the Young Sheik. So. We could put Hulk Hogan in the camel clutch. Alright, so, um... I guess for Shotzi... Oh, yeah, Nia Jax is it. Hmm. I'll think about it. Wow, wow, wow. I think it's time for someone to get the pink slip, if you know what I mean. Ha <laughs> ah, ha! Back out, Troy, you're about to be fired! If I could have a minute. No! <sighs> What is it, Troy? I honestly don't have time for your tone tonight. I'm trying to manage a show. Yeah, so shut the f up. I'm not going in the corner and crying. Well, yeah, it's a good thing you're wearing white. Oh, wait, it's a terrible time for you to have white pa pants. You're about to be and about what I'm about to tell you. My tone? I would never use a tone with you. I, I think you're doing a great job. Top notch. That's a f line. Give me a reason why I won't put you in a match against Gunther. Ha <laughs> ha, very funny. Oh, you're serious. I guess now that I'm the management, you have to suck up to me. Ass kiss. Wait, I, I, I can say ass. Ass kisser. I'm not sucking up. I, I think 
Your ideas are genius, boss. That's Troy kissing, kissing our rear. Of course they are, Troy. I'm smart. Now what's up? What do you want? Yeah, Becky and Bailey. They're being particularly difficult in hounding us to be named Bianca's next challenger at Survivor Series. Ah, I'm sure they snuck into your DMs too, but I'm used to superstars pestering us for opportunities. <laughs> no offense, but this is getting out of hand. How about I put, how about I put them against you, handicap match? How do you want me to handle it? I fought Troy. I don't know why you think this is rocket science, Troy. Just have Becky and Bailey face each other. Winner gets the title opportunity. So easy, any capable WWE producer could think of it. Which I guess you're not. <laughs> of course, I'll set it up. So sorry, boss. You're absolutely right. I'll do better next time. Really appreciate your guidance and support. <sighs> I could get used to this version of you, Troy. So do I, but it's missing something. Maybe a match against Gunther. It can't, is it possible for Troy? Is someone... Did someone download Troy in the... Did someone create Troy in the community page? I will love that. I will love him against Gunther. Wow, wow, wow. Pain in my rear number two. What do you want? I'm not here to fight. Wow, wow, wow. Fine. Good. I don't want to fight either. Fine. Then maybe we can work together on my idea? And what's that? Survivor Series. I know for a fact that not only has Raw not announced a main event, but Regal had nothing in the plans yet. So, let's take the bull by the horns and do something truly spectacular. War Games! I can't just book a War Games match, Shotzi. Why not? Are you GM in name only? No, I mean, I love war games as much as the next person, but it's not a match to be taken lightly. You need a reason. Something that merits putting two teams who want each other's throats inside a double ring cage to battle it out with abandon. Who'd even be the captains? I captained my team in NXT and I was excellent. Ah, so this is the classic, my pitch is that I should be in a main event pitch, right? There are rules to booking. Excuse me, but when did Little Miss TBD Rebel, who puts people through tables, become a lawful good rule follower? Don't you ever just want to smash things for the hell of it anymore? On one hand, she has a point. Also, she pronounced it wrong. It's not war games. It's... Lower your, lower the volumes for this. War games. Or in a toxic tone. Lower, lower the voice. Lower, lower the headphones, everyone. Lower the volume. War games. That's how you say it. I would like to put a clip of William Regal saying war games, but um. WWE copyright. Actually, you may have a point. I do miss that. So let's screw the so-called rules and do this. Put yourself in it against me, and we can absolutely destroy each other in that cage. We pick teams, go all out, and millions of people tune in to watch the joyful carnage. The two of us are perfect for war games. You're the captain, and I already drive a tank to the ring for crying out loud. You know what, Shotzi? It might not be a terrible idea. Let me think on it. That's all I'm asking for. Dibs on Asuka. Alita. Well, if it isn't the new GM of Raw. Lita. Hey, this is awkward, huh? 
Oh. Alexa Bliss story. Don't worry about it. As far as I'm concerned, the past is in the past. I'm not here to attack you or get any revenge. At least not on you. On try? Uh, then why are you here? I love that even in your first outing as GM, you put your focus on a tried and tested rivalry. Maybe it even offered some closure to Charlotte and Rhea. <laughs> I doubt that. Yeah, honestly, me too. But maybe it'll be different for me. I still feel like I have some loose ends from over the years to tie Ooh. up with Trish. You don't say. Hey, at least we know we have a problem, and that's the first step. Can you book me in a match against her? It's just better if it comes from you. Trish and Lita in a match on oh, my we can, rock? Oh, we immediately it would be say my yes. pleasure. Amy and Trish. Lita. Lita versus Trish Nash. Treat it all grounds as they face each other one on one. Alright. You know what actually funny part is? Wait, let me. Last year, Lita got attacked. And it revealed it was revealed it was Trish. Trish did not. Lita didn't get her revenge. I think you know what? Let's let's bring reality into this. Let's have Lita. Let's back Lita in. Well, that means we get to choose who the who we're facing. All right. Two of the greatest of all time yeah. and one of the greatest Sorry. rivalries of I all mean, time. Ah, 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 and then we got the, ah, right now. Trish and Lita have inspired like millions around Lita. the world. Props to our GM, the captain, for making Thanks. this match on Raw tonight. I've had the honor of calling matches between these two before, but it never gets old seeing these two legends lock up. Drop kick <laughs> hits the mark. Oh, double axe handle. Got their opponent set up. Ah, oh, drop kick to the spine. Lita revving this crowd mm. up, trying to get them behind her. <laughs> Picked up. Beautiful spin out power bomb. That was a power bomb with one message in mind: absolute destruction. We're gonna platter with a DDT. Smash. She's taking some big hits here. Uh, yeah, Lita's building a way to take out the competition. Uh, Fighting back, however, punches to the midsection. Uh, She's taking things to ringside. Uh, An elbow will break that up. Stratus at the mercy of her opponent. Such intensity coming out of Lita now. Whoa! Look out! Ah! Oh no! Crashing hard onto the floor. I screwed up. That was playing with fire and getting burned. The decision to take such a risk at this juncture is questionable. Chop! Oh gosh. Gut red suplex. Making it look easy. Oh, Lita avoids oh. contact. Setting foot in the ring now. Come on. Hurricane Rana. Unbelievable athleticism. It's incredible the inventiveness we are seeing on display here. Ooh, she hit the corner hard. Ooh, sharp elbow. Nice cross body. Uh-oh. Oh, spine. Oh, stomach. Oh. Stops the attack with a hit to the gut. Using the oh. elbow as a weapon. No. Nope. And a reversal by Lita. Ooh, 
Clothesline delivered. And Stratus got the full force of that blow. There's been plenty of action in this match, uh, and the cost of that is really uh, showing my now. Spot, uh, my torso. Uh. Ah, uh, I should learn my limit. Big form. Ah, uh. I uh, had that well scouted. Oh, red. Is it enough? The cover. Not a whole lot of luster behind that kick out. Trish making a mockery of her opponent. as he nope. proves to be too quick. Oh, uh. what a kick. Ah! Uh. This one is headed outside, guys. Oh, right to the kidneys. Ah. Awesome oh, uh. oh, and then the chest is You wild. be quiet. In the midsection. A twist of fate. That kind of offense is what cemented Lita's legacy. Toss back into the ring. Lita looking to fly, perhaps. From the top. Ah! Oh, what a moonsault. Did Lita clinch this? She's going up. Top rope here. One more time. From the top. Take it to the extreme with the lead assault. The lights are dimming for Trish. I didn't, I didn't say victory. three finish. I said, well, good day. Here is your winner, Lita. I did it, Lita. This one I avenge you from the attack way, last but year. But it is Lita standing tall um. right now. Yeah, we knew coming into this match that she and Trish knew each other well, and that would come into play here. But we weren't sure who would get the upper hand. How Impressive to see Lita get Trish the win the here. Fly. I actually want to know. Okay, there's the, well, there's the Royal Rumble, so I'll, I won't count the belt. You know, not including the, um, wait, what if I make it? Okay. Wow, 13 matches. This is match number 14. And that's for um all the times they fought. 33 times. But in reality, just one-on-one. -on -one, 14 matches. And, and oh my gosh. What was your skinny one, you dumb What do you want? <laughs> Come to congratulate me on a successful show. Yeah. I was just out back soaking in the success of the Trish and Lita match. So you didn't see the number one contender match with Becky and Bailey? Did you even book it? I bet you didn't. No, that match practically booked itself. Why? Who won? Who are we putting against Bianca at Survivor Series? We have a problem. Damage control ran in during the match. And at first it looked like maybe a straightforward DQ victory for Becky. But then she got irked and went after them. And technically the bell rang at some point, but with all the fighting that broke out outside the ring, nobody really won. And we still need a challenger for Bianca. I blame you, Troy. That was on you. That was on you, you dumb mother How about that? You want, you want for that? How about this? How about this? I put you in a match of Bianca. You versus Bianca, and I want Bianca being the out of you. I don't want anything. You can beat Bianca. Well, let me talk. Let me remind you. Let me remind you. She carried Otis. She carried a 300 pound man. So Bianca will definitely whip your. And you want know while I'm at it? While I'm at it, I'll make it even more better. It's a handicap match now for you. 
It's you versus Bianca and Gunther. I'm gonna see Gunther chop your If I may make a meager suggestion. No. Survivor Series is right around the corner. You may just have to step up as GM and make a decision. No, we exactly. still have one Raw left before Survivor Series. Let's do a rematch. Becky versus Bailey to determine Bianca's challenger. Do you really think the match will go any differently this time around? You mother... You stupid... You stupid... You're really stupid, are you? A five-year-old kid can do better than him. I do. Because as much as it pains me to admit it, you're right about one thing. No, it ain't. I need to step up as GM. So I'll be serving as special guest referee. And the best part is... And the best part is, I'm book you against Gunther. Someone, please! Someone, please! With all due respect, what was that Becky Bailey match? Oh. I'm not gonna. Am I gonna read everything? Oh my gosh. Okay, both are world champions in real life. Um, eeny, meeny, miny, mo, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Bianca got her revenge on. I think it was right for Bianca to beat Becky. Let's do Bailey. Yeah. At this time, maybe Bailey will win. My advantageous hands. See you in stripes next week. I'll be there. I love seeing Lita and Trish on my TV like that again. Respect, Bioko. Next time, invite me too, though. Just thinking how Survivor Series is coming up, and Ryoko hasn't announced any epic, super popular, exciting match type yet. If only someone had a great idea for one. Bam. Don't make me throw the chair at you again. Becky versus Bailey. And Ryoko will be a special guest referee. Wait! I could have done the entrance! I forgot to turn on the entrance to special guest referee. I know there was an entrance for that. Our general manager, the captain, promises that we'll have a number one contender. Ooh. Use fans count to help Bailey. I'll think about it. Our special guest referee is up to you to enforce the rules of the match. This includes pain counts, submission checks, ring counts, and disqualification. You have full discretion to enforce these rules as you choose, but WWE will always be watching closely and may replace you if you fall to perform your duties. Oh, I miss SmackDown vs. Raw 2007. We get to be special guest referees on that match, and uh, we get to do whatever we want. You start the match in referee mode, which allows you to pin, check pins and submission, call rope breaks, and perform a ring downward prop anytime you can warn a superstar by pressing square. And exit referee mode by pressing the touchpad, which allows you to perform standard superstar actions such as attacks. Ooh. When you need to perform a referee action, you can roll the controls. Okay. Officials will be judging your performance in referee meter at the top screen. If the meter depletes completely, then a new official is sent. This can be disabled by turning off referee meter in the match option before starting the match. Wait. Interesting. By the end of this match, will it be Becky Lynch or Bailey? We'll know soon enough, and with Cap as special guest cover here. 
And she kicks out right away. Okay, now the jig is up. Our ref's agenda showed itself on that pin attempt. Look, yeah, I was uh, look, I'm running to three can be hard, but maybe someone should remind our official that it's part of the job. Oh, oh my gosh. Extending their opponent's arm out. Oh, oh man, leg drop arm breaker. Big knee to the midsection. She heads out of the ring. Interesting strategy. All right, what are you doing? What are you gonna do, Becky? Oh, using the rope to their advantage. Punishing their opponent. Pull during a submission press, oh, if they tap out during your check, you can call. It's also perform a screw job. Ooh. Double underhook. The armbar! Oh, she fights her way out of the armbar. Nice, nice, nice. Come on, Bailey, you got this. For someone who claims not to care about the idiots in the crowd, Bailey's sure spending a lot of time trying to get a reaction out of them right now. Ooh, cap kick on the mark. And Bailey's resolve might be wavering here. Bailey, the ball attempt here from Becky Lynch. And she kicks out. Good job by the ref, seeing the kick out right away. We saw a double underhook. What was that? They weren't even near the ropes. So, so, Saxon. And an elbow. Lynch pausing to soak up the adulation. Credit. She wasn't trying to influence the result there. Oh, target acquired and destroyed. Oh, just turn that around. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Face for a whoa, 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 don't do that. Don't do that, Becky. Suck in the tree of woe. No escape in sight. Stuck in the tree of woe. They are doing whatever they please. I see how it is. Going to take any shortcut to bypass a clean competition. Yeah, hey, there's nothing wrong with a shortcut, Saxton. Suplex into the makes the cover. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. And the referee was in perfect position for the count. A great cadence with that count. Both superstars showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. I don't know if it's a good idea to argue look, with the look, official look, like look, look. this. Yeah, yeah, see, what? Uh-oh. Face first. Whoa, 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 come jaw on, jacket. come on, Becky, come on, Becky, come on. Bailey's got it hooked. Shoulders are down. Two and a kick out of ten. Oh, wait, you with the job our ref did there. Our official showing she's a professional of the hot. Oh, kick right to the back of the leg. Here they go. Cross play by Bailey. Is Bailey closing this out? Two count. What a kick out. I don't believe it. Oh, that my was gosh. a huge kick out that might have taken oh my everything gosh. that is left in Becky Lynch. And now there must be a level of annoyance in Bailey. And now she's looking to go top row. Flyer. She certainly no, took a chance there. High risk with no reward. The close of this match is just ahead. There is no way this can go on for much longer. Rolling neck snap. Oh, now 
Now she's looking to apply the pressure with this submission maneuver. Bailey. What do you mean, North Submission? What do you mean, North Submission? She catches Bailey with a counter. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. What a shot. She heads out, but this one can be lost by countout. Oh! Strong kick. My goodness. Wow, wiping that smoke look right off her face. Leg drop. Defensive oh, we're halfway the there. Ends that. And now she's getting back into the ring. And that goes to show you what Bailey thinks of her opponent here. There you go. Rep there you go. Count stop. Here comes the man. Becky Lynch is rolling. The Irish last kicker fired up. And the match continues to be teamwork. Becky with a takedown, looking for the disarmor. Can she cinch it in? The disarmor locked in. This will break your arm in a hurry. Can Becky's opponent hang on? No Perhaps thinking something else here. Not sure why, though, Michael. She seemed to have it really cinched in. The ref is not happy look, look, with look, something. Look, 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 That's look, 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 look. Okay, wait, Becky, Becky. See? Becky Lynch looking for it. There it is. Manhandle slam. Can that finish Bailey? Two. No contact being made with the ropes, and yet our referee is calling for a rope break. That's awful. Ooh, Becky just aggressively going after that arm. Bailey could be thinking about the end for the Rose Clan. Has Bailey ended it there? Cover. Two. She kicks out. I what? don't believe it. Becky is alive and the fire is still Good. burning. You Good. come Good. at the man, Good. you'll have to come Bailey, harder Bailey, than that. Bailey. And Bailey can barely believe it. Bailey had her dead to rights. Thought she had the three, but it was a factor of milliseconds. Nice Japanese arm drag. Oh, oh. <laughs> Shoulder up before the count started. And okay, that count shows she's not bad at this ref thing. Our official didn't show any favorites with that count. Oh, straight forward. Kick to the abdomen. <laughs> My goodness, is this even legal? I don't think so. My God, enough. All right. Well, it, okay, come on, Bailey. Let's End it now. It. Almost ended it there. And the referee was right there with a proper count. Give the ref credit. That's a fair count. Drop kick to the back. Bailey's gaining the upper hand. Lynch is getting a taste of Bailey's mean streak. And that definitely made solid impact. Well, Heads outside, end it, but this one ring. has to end in the ring. This one's about to be over. Bailey the belly. And Bailey there piles out of the damage she's already dished out. Bailey must be having thoughts of ending things soon. Oh, quite an effective counter. Becky able to stop the blitz that was coming her way. Becky weathered the storm and wants to create a flurry of her own. And now she delivers her back into the ring. <laughs> Bailey trying to fire herself up. She goes right into the disarmor. She's gonna tap. She tap, tap, tap. It's over. Lynch has Bailey right where mm. she wants her. Oh man! Clearly tapped out, and the ref is just ignoring it. Becky Lynch from behind. Oh, oh. manhandle 
slam. Becky has opened up an opportunity. What? You gotta be kidding me. How? How? Kicking out at one. Come on, Bailey. Is unheard of. And Becky Lynch is fuming. She did all that work and still it wasn't enough. What a reversal by Bailey. There's press and Luthes press. Powerless position to be in right now. Oh, right to the throat. Ooh, ooh, treading all over their opponent. Gotta get back in the ring, Bailey. Come on, come on. Why in the, the outside? This could get wild. Boot to the gut will stop anyone in their tracks. Throws her back in from ringside. <laughs> Becky moves out of the way. Oh. Oh my God. Uh oh. Look at this. The arm might snap here. Oh, I think she's going to do it. Go the ropes. This. Uh oh. This ref is blatantly ignoring the tap out. This is disgusting. Obviously allowing for permanent damage to occur. Bailey is reeling and real danger now. Oh, look at Becky. Ooh, manhandle slam. Dang it. Will that sew this up for Becky? Seriously, that wasn't a rope break. Not even close. Oh! Counters that. Oh, look at... She got the shoulders down. No, she kicks out. She calls that a fair count? Nonsense. Every official has their own cadence, but let's not be ridiculous. Listen, this may be unprecedented, but I think it's a good move because... This official's terrible. I can't understand how she can't just call the match down the middle. Oh, my gosh. There are growing pains, Cole. This is a very difficult position to be an official in WWE. Uh. Oh, growing pains, nothing. A match of this caliber deserves a fair and impartial referee. And if she couldn't handle the job, she shouldn't have volunteered for it. Now... than an actual WWE official. So let's take it over. Let's see just how... Playing possum! Whoa! Playing possum! Oh, my! And the resiliency to win this one. Look, see? Bailey won. Here is your winner! Bailey! Bailey stood in the middle of the ring and found an answer for the man. Okay, Michael, well... this came down to heart. It came down Becky, to desire. It was Becky's fault. And tonight, Bailey would not accept anything but victory. Yeah. Good job, Bailey. Good job. You did it. You did it. I blame Becky because she took a long time. You were trying to hawk my stream, Becky. Uh-oh. You made her mad. And she's... How about I fight you, Becky? Geneva, look what happened. They screwed me. Well... That was something. Hey, you were the one who said I should put my finger on the scale. Yeah, but I thought that and don't get caught part was implied. <sighs> Guess not. I wasn't actively trying to get caught. Too bad you don't have the chance to course correct the championship match before Survivor Series. But maybe I do. How? Survivor Series is this weekend. You can't send Becky and Bailey back out there tonight for another rematch. No, but there's another option. As someone said recently, I'm yep. Miss TBD Rebel, not a lawful good rule follower. 
and Raw is a three-hour show. Yep. There's an announcement I need to make. Triple threat. All right, Miss TVD Rebel. Whatever you've got up your sleeve, good luck. All you know I will. A major news. War games? War games? War games? I want to try Rogue War games. This is the second time we've seen the acting Raw general manager in the ring tonight, but this time she has a special announcement. Here's hoping this goes more smoothly than her stint as special guest referee. Shop Saxon! GM, I'm not deaf to the concerns of the WWE universe. Specifically, that my involvement in our number one contender match earlier tonight may have made it look like management was biased towards Bayley. I assure you, my intent as GM is simply to put on the best show for the WWE Universe. And that applies to not just Raw, but Survivor Series. War Games? As such, it is my duty to inform you that Bianca Belair uh, will uh, not be defending the Women's World Championship this weekend. Bianca's being pulled You're from all. Survivor Series? You all. She will not be defending this weekend because it's clear Bailey and Becky Lynch are not done yet. I just hope they have allies to rally to their side. Eight fighters, two teams of four. War games. War games. War games. War games. War games at Survivor Series. I'm not missing this one. Well, we're paid to be there, Saxton. I know, but it's still incredibly exciting. Oh, Troy, you're going down, Troy. You're welcome. War Games. Within less than a week to assemble the teams. OMG, War Games is a brilliant idea. Who thought? Oh my gosh. I think Shotzi's angry. Bailey, how do you feel? You really did it this time, didn't you, you dummy? Hey, I made you win. Hey, I chose you to win. I'm sorry you're not getting the championship match at Survivor Series, but I'm the GM and this is my call. Should have just booked the War Games match from the start, honestly. Want to be on my team? Why do you want me on your team? I think it's pretty clear from your time as GM that you've been going into business for yourself here and just doing whatever you can to scrape by. And that's exactly what I look for in damage control. Is also going to be part so of So what do you say? Join me, Dakota, and Io in the fight to secure my WWE Women's World Championship match? I'll get back to you. Hmm. Thanks, Becky. I'm still not over what you did in my match with Bailey. Wow. But thank you for making it right. Yeah. Glad we're okay. We are. And I respect your hustle. You've made a lot of bold choices since coming to WWE. It's one of the reasons I want you to be on my War Games team. Really? I like your instincts, especially when you get in trouble and have to be <gasps> quickly on your feet. Heck, oh. I even trust your instincts. Team with me, and I'll let you pick the rest of the War Games team. Uh, let me think about it. Geneva. Hey, I've been looking for you. I thought we were going to meet outside of catering. <laughs> Turns out I was pretty busy in here. Both Becky and Bailey want me to be on their war games team. You can't be serious. You lost this up so badly and they both want you on their team? Hmm. What can I say? I'm a catch. I swear there's something in the water around here that allows you to walk away from the consequences of your actions unscathed. <laughs> I'm sure putting yourself into the main event while you're also acting GM will be no different. Thanks for another great promoter lecture. 
Look, I know you're gonna do it anyway. Who are you teaming with? Important decisions crucial to your mind rise are marked with these. These icons signif signify a decision that changed the trajectory of your story or which superstars might align with you in the future. Try playing undisputed and unleash multiple times. Ooh. Sorry, Bailey. Becky had me at choosing my team. Becky said she'd let me pick the rest of the team. Sorry, I'm joining her Be side. Sorry, Bailey. Can't wait for you to get absolutely no flack for putting yourself into the match that you screw. set up. We kind of favor Have Becky. you decided who else you'll have to join you and Becky? Can't screw it up. Wait, what? Becky said she picked. All right. It's like two allies. You and Becky take on Bailey's team. I got robbed. I have 22 allies. Why can't why can't Oscar be my ally? Um, Lita or Trish? Yep. Okay. Well. Well. All else fails. Um, well, okay. Well, I what? Okay, actually, never mind, because then use the OBS. That's great. The winner is. We're getting Lita. We're getting Lita. Oh, wait, actually, now that I think about it, I could have done this. All right. So, Lita and lastly. Sally. Well, good luck. I'm sure it'll be interesting. Becky or Bailey? Sorry. Wait. I'm going first. 
Am I going to go in first? War Games is a match with no rival. Two rings, ah, one ah. giant cage, and eight superstars ready to risk ah. it all for the big Who's the damage victory? control? Not only is pride on the line here, Cole, but depending on which team wins, we're going to have either Becky Lynch or Bayley as the number one contender to Bianca Belair's title. That's true, but first things first, no one in this match should be looking past the goal of surviving War Games. Knee finds the abdomen. Ooh, she responds with a counter. Ah. Uh. Is that Raquel? Did they get Raquel? What a right hook. Big right hand. Went into the corner now. Oh, costly error there. Oh. Bailey turns it around. You know, I actually like the stage oh, Survivor what a Series. Smash. That is just insulting. Ow. Oh. Just disrespectful. This is how you get a fire up with help. Anger. Lands face first. Ascending the War Games cage. No idea what her plan can be. From the top, big miss right there. Ooh. Oh, nicely done. Seated suplex. Here they come, looking to give their team the upper hand as soon as possible. I guess she plans to add injury to insult once she comes in to join the fray. Heck yeah, bitch. She's an uppercut. Oh, God. Brutal chop block. All's fair in love and war, gentlemen. I saw nothing but effective offense. Look at the amount of members on each team now. This truly has the potential to become one-sided. Lands an elbow. And Bailey connected oh. nicely there. Dragon screw. Watch her set up in the corner. Oh, uh, stiff uppercut. All right. Ah, oh, look at this. Hair pull mat slam. This has got to hurt. Trying to fight with a hurt arm is no easy task. Yeah. Going after the arm here. And seconds left before the odds are evened here. Big first right into the buckle. Out of the cage and rushing in to erase the numbers advantage. Well, 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 Dakota Kai. Great counter. Landing a big hit with that hammer. You fool. Boom. You fool. What happened? Sledgehammer right to yeah. the gut. Watch out. Oh. Driving the face down. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. Thank you for giving us the weapon, bit. Double under oh. made her pay for her mistake. Sit on to the arm bar. Well, this isn't gonna win the fall, but it's gonna. She fights her way out of the arm bar. <laughs> Sending her over to the other ring, utilizing the unique surroundings. Uh-oh. Punched to the stomach and stopped in their tracks. She catches Kai with a big counter. Timer's almost up. This next entry gives their team the advantage inside the cage. Oh, man. Oh, oh. Bursting out oh. of the cage, eager to capitalize Wait, on the oh. situation. Wait, oh, oh, oh. Out of the way in time. Fly. Well, that'll leave a mark. Giving her team the numbers advantage and bringing a bit of backup into the yeah. ring. The numbers advantage wasn't enough. Looking under the ring for a weapon now. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, the yes, Lita. The wind out yes, of Lita. Oh. 
Dakota Kai. Crucifix. A couple of knees and then another one, and that'll force the break. Nice. Whoa, she just chucked her over to the other ring. Catching a drop kick. Little help. Lynch responds. Thank you, it's setting up for, oh no, wait a minute, wait a minute. Time is ticking away, shortly we'll have a fresh competitor to even the odds. Look at this, she releases the hold. That's a little surprising, no? Becky's got bad intentions in mind. Door swings open and out they come. And their team could definitely use their Well, help. well, That's the big control. moment happening. Meanwhile, Lynch, what a fall. Climb the cage. Not the smartest of ideas. Here we go. Oh! No. And a close line counter. Good job, Becky. Dakota Kai looking for an adjustment here. Kai will factor. Dakota can taste it now. She's between a rock and a hard place right now. And EO is in a daze. It could be the end for her soon. She is. Ain't nobody getting up from that. Oh, man. Oh. oh, basically hammering their opponent into the oh. floor. We have got oh, numbers advantage in coming as the countdown is about to run out. Becky Lynch, horse around. Eo's in dire straits. Cage opens, and the strategy now has to be oh, to take charge. Play the numbers help. game to your advantage now. Giving her team the oh. advantage, but she's looking for her own advantage now. From the top, nobody home. Oh. I can't believe the decision to jump off of the top of the cage. I think that was decided before even reaching the top, Saxton. Kick! She's getting back up, but she might oh. be down again soon. Absolutely punishing. Oh. Uh, oh, Kendo's uh, thing wrapped around the head. Boom! And these attacks are spelling nothing but uh, trouble. Uh, She's up on top of the wall, but leaving the cage would mean forfeiting the match. Oh, no! Punishing impact off the cage. Both of these superstars pushing the limits of what their bodies can take. Couldn't have been higher. You have to wonder if hesitation creeped in and made things go awry. Oh, and she got out of there. Oh, Tamina. I love her help. Great strength. Oh, my gosh. Here. So much for us. Uh-oh. I don't like this idea one bit. From the top. Lita sold by Lita. That might clinch this for Lita.
Dakota with plans on ending this. 